Hey, welcome back. And uh, yeah, you saw the forecast there, you saw the traffic. But you know what? Uh, traffic getting busier because a lot of kids are heading back to school today. Mm -hmm. But you know, there's a lot of back to school jitters. And with us is Sarah White and uh, our mindfully frugal mom with some great ideas. Three things you should do every night to make the following day go smoother uh, at school. I love this concept. It makes the whole morning run smoother. Right. Well, I mean, the, my primary thought in doing this is that I don't trust my morning self. <laughs> I do not trust my pre-coffee self Step to do anything. One, don't trust your pre-coffee right. self. Right. I just so I just assume that I'm a bumbling idiot in the morning, <laughs> and I do everything the night before because okay. I basically am okay. a bumbling idiot. You, in the you know what? You know yeah. what you're you know yourself best. Yeah. Um, so and you know we get up early, and if you have kids, you. There's arguments, so I just try to eliminate all of that. So the first thing I always do is I make lunches the night before. Okay. Or have the kids make their lunches the night before. Um, and I usually do it right after dinner when I'm doing the dinner dishes. Because, right. like, you're already in the kitchen. You're already making a mess. Yeah. Just get it all done. Put it in the refrigerator. You know, and um, one of the things I do to help and have the kids help with that is I have my little um, lunch making organizational bin so here. So this is a bin, and this has what does it have in there? It has just got... all their containers and um, you know reusable bags oh. and like all the things that they would need to make a lunch. So so we're not running around looking in different For covers. Bags so just and things. so the kids know where all their stuff is, and they can. I love that. They make their sandwiches, throw in a piece of fruit, so they do it. Okay, and there's no argument or no upset crying over where is my lunch bag or exactly. my lunch box it's all in this bin exactly okay great so um, make lunch the night before. So we always do lunch the night before. The other thing is I always set out clothes the night before mm -hmm. um, because I know, you know, thankfully my kids are pretty good about it, but I know a lot of people have arguments with their kids about oh, what yeah. they're going to wear in mm -hmm. the morning, and I just don't, I don't have the patience right. to do that. You're not, you're not tolerating In the that. morning. You just I just can't. can't. Right, yeah. I physically cannot yeah. do that. So we pick out the clothes the night before. Um, if there's any issues, we can okay. go over them then. Okay. Yeah, and the other thing I do is we always, I always make my kids, and I do too, shower the night before. Ah. Shower and, um, you know, we shower, we lay out our clothes, our lunch is made. Um, and I also usually have their backpacks packed with the shoes they're going to wear the next day. Wow, in you're front not of messing <laughs> around. Okay. No. Well, you know, it seems like it's because I'm organized. It's not. It's because I know... You that I will not do it in the morning, I, you know, and I, I will forget things. I think that is the first step, though. So I love this. Get the lunch prepared the night before. Mm -hmm. Get the clothes prepared the night before. Uh, and you do this, too, probably. I do it all for myself, yeah. too. This, because, is, you could yeah. this could be an adult. This could be for adults. Absolutely. And then shower the night before so you're not running around or, you know, right. poking around in the morning like, uh, can't get yourself in gear. You've right. already done all the stuff you need to do. Exactly. That's amazing. Exactly. So really the only thing we have to do in the morning is eat breakfast, brush teeth, and put clothes on. There you go. That's that's pretty simple. That's that's I've gotten it down to those few things. That's your speed, isn't it? Yeah, that's about all I can do. I need to take some of this advice. This is great <laughs> advice that I'm gonna have right down when I get home. I'm gonna make a little list. I'm going to do all three tonight. Thank you yes. so much, Sarah. Oh, thanks for having me. And I know your kids just went back yesterday, so I know you're all excited about they that. They did. Mm -hmm. All right, here's to a smoother school year and smoother mornings for you. Local headlines coming up next.